Hi, I'm Dave Greip, and today we're here to talk about the MH144-1A triaxial mounting block. This mounting block is designed for use in situations where triaxial sensors may not be appropriate or may be cost prohibitive. The MH144-1A triaxial mounting block has quarter 28 tapped holes in five faces, and in the sixth face, it has a through bolt, quarter 28 or M6, which is designed for use either with a mounting tab or in a drilled and tapped hole on a machine surface. To mount the mounting block, take your wrench, insert it through the top, line up the captive bolt, and screw it into the mounting tab or surface. Torque should be approximately five to seven foot-pounds. Once the mounting block is in place and has been properly torqued, it's time to mount the sensors onto the mounting block. To do this, simply take your sensors, mount the vertical sensor, the horizontal sensor, and the axial sensor. Once the sensors have been hand tightened, it's time to securely fasten them using a torque wrench to the proper torque of five to seven foot-pounds. Once the sensors are securely fastened, it's time to make your connections. Today, we'll be using some of our various connectors and cables to demonstrate some of what's available from CTC. Our A2A connector is a polycarbonate connector with a threaded stainless steel locking ring. Tighten it down on the sensor, and it's ready to go. Our B2N connector is a silicone boot with a nylon insert. Simply line up the keyway and slide it firmly onto the sensor, securely fastened. Our V2N connector on yellow Teflon has a threaded boot with an IP68 rating. Slide it on, twist to seal. I'm Dave Gripe, and this has been a review of CTC's MH144-1A triaxial mounting block. Remember, when reliability matters, Connect to confidence. Connect to CTC.